Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Jurassic World Evolution 2 campaign where today we are back on uh, Pennsylvania it is, that is right. I was about to say an, I was about to say an island because I'm so used to saying that. It's going to be difficult guys, like it's going to be hard not saying Isla Muerta or Tacaño or vehicle under threat. Ooh, Coco's having his fun, and he broke my door, and he's sitting, oh, so, oh my god, I love that sitting animation, he just looks so, he reminds me of a puppy or something, you know, when puppies, like, you know, sit on a couch or something, and they sort of lean back, maybe it's just my dog that does that, but she leans back and's like, I am cute and elegant, and he's got the look of, uh, what are you talking about, I didn't do it. It's just so cute to me. I don't know what it is, but I really love that animation. I know, that's what you want to hear, guys. You want to see whether I love an animation or not. But we need to go on expeditions, if I recall. And we're going to go for dinosaurs that we don't have. So let's see, Deinonychus. We, can we not get Deinonychus? We can't get Deinonychus. What's here? Fargo, Diplodocus. Why can I not get Diplodocus? And let's see, Baryonyx. I'm not going to get Baryonyx because I want to get the dinosaurs that, like, aren't done. So, we'll get Chasmosaur... We'll get Parasaurolophus first. Let's see. How... So, we need four. So, we'll do... Nope, that's only one. We need two and two. Okay, so, start task. And then after that, we should probably go for... Hmm. Oh, there's a T-Rex going on in the background. I don't know why. I'm thinking we'll probably go for Taurosaurus. I don't think I want to do Chasmosaurus because I know it's going to need more than that. But, well, we'll find out. So, what do we need to do else? Do we have all the buildings? We could do some research while we wait. Like, I want to slow down and just do some of the research. So, structures, let's see. What are these? What is this actually? Co core facility, fun. Okay, so this is efficiency upright. Okay, so unable to research. Oh, we need more skill. Hold on, can we, can we get this? How do you upgrade the scientists? Okay, so I'm so confused. How can you... Where's the science facility? That's control. Staff center. View scientists. Staff options, like... Okay, we can't really train them. Train. Research required. But, how do you research the training? That, that's weird. Dinosaurs. Pa paleontology. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, are you guys done? Okay, well, we'll just speed it up then. Because, uh, I don't know how to w work this entirely. Oh, so that's how you hide the objectives. You do this. Okay, that's weird. Okay, are we almost done? I don't know. So, we... Also, I did do a change off screen, guys. Um, a small one, but I actually... Ex Oh, there we go. That's the Paras. Five Parasaurolophus found. How many did we capture? All five. Excellent. And we are going to move them in here because I know that they are all comfortable with them in here. Oh, God. And here they come. Wee! <laughs> and now let's um slow down this and check out the Paras, which... Oh... Oh, thank God, they have their Lost World calls. Thank you, yes. Now, also, we will need to add task and 
We need you to check them out if you wouldn't mind. Please do that. And where is it going? Oh, it's... Oh, wait. Did I have a second one? Who's directing? Where are you going? Dude. Wh where are you going? Wh where are you going? Come on. What the hell? I gave you a tap. Okay, that is weird. That is seriously weird. Like, I did ask him to... Like, I know it's supposed to do it, like, once or twice, but it should be done more. Now let's get Taurosaurus, which... This is Taurosaurus? Okay, so we need four, so... We'll put you guys on it. And then we will need to rest you. So... We need to make an enclosure, I just realized that, so first let's go into enclosures. For no, where's the hatchery? Viewing vent. Okay, do we not have viewing towers? I do remember we had viewing towers. Okay, that, maybe it's just, oh wait, no, they're in locked in um, challenge mode, I believe. Yeah, because I know there's some things unlocked in challenge mode, which... I'm hoping isn't including dinosaurs, but I am worried that, like, certain dinosaurs, like, the deluxe DLC dinosaurs, because I have the deluxe pack, I already got that in the pre-order, but uh, I hope that's not the case, because I want to have them unlocked straight away. Like, I like challenge mode, but I don't want it to be too long. Alright, there we go, I think... That should be good, and we need power, it seems. Okay, there is something being very loud, and it's... And I know it is in-game, but... I don't know what it is. Is it a dinosaur? Like, it's definitely a dinosaur. Now, how are the powers? Okay, what the hell is he doing? What are you doing in here? Oh crap, he's going... Okay, for gosh sakes, I told you to just go and do... them. So he didn't do what I asked him to do. He j Oh god, and the door is kind of... Well, one's missing, and the other's just, you know... Not really locked or so... Ow, I can't drive either, so I'm probably not helping. Okay, so, hold on. Can you run them over? Okay, so why are you so slow now? Like, in the first game, you were like a bullet. Oh, transmission. Five torsos found. How many did we capture? Ah, uh, one of them got away. Let's move them to right over here. And we need to actually get this ready. First with some water. And then we need to add a gate. Gate right here. And then add a... Add this, please. And then... Now, how's torsos? Let's get a good look at you. Oh, you look nice. And, you know, I like how the night is much better in this game. Like, in the first game, it always felt way too dark. Even when it was a clear sky, it showed it to be way too dark. And I think he's trying to itch himself with the ground, except he was kind of floating. Now, his health is lowering, so we do need to get him some food. Probably some ground fiber, because that's what the other ceratopsians like. What That's ground... There's ground fiber, and we'll put that here. That should be good. And then we'll add some forest, just in case. Now, that should be good. Let's go and do Chasmosaurus, because he's the final one. You're right here. Yep, two Chasmosaurus. And I know you are getting tired, so we're going to go with you and you. And then I'm going to go into... Where's the staff center? 
Ah, oh, God, I'm not used to this, this one. View scientist and unassigned. We're going to give you rest. And you, you haven't done anything. And we'll rest you to probably... Well, probably not both of you. And I'm actually thinking about firing that other lady because she's, like, way too low. She has only one. And also, I just realized with those Chasmos, we're going to need an enclosure for them as well, if I do say so. So, we'll just turn this around here. And I do like the new viewing vents, actually. Like, they're much smaller, which is a good thing for me, because, like... Especially, like, I used to really like, um, in the first game, I would sometimes make enclosures where I had it not attached, like they were elevated, or I'd use the smaller fence because it wasn't really that much of a bother, but now, this one's so much better, like, you'll be able to get into, like, better s positions and stuff for me. At least that's my opinion. And, also, guys, I actually realized how short this tr um, is actually going to be for, like, a campaign. Because, like, we're going to be done this actually very soon, I think. Because, well, if we're already, like, 80% done almost, according to the status check of the campaign. Which, I don't know how I feel about that. Because, like, considering the first game's was like massive now we do need to get rid of some of this forest so we'll cut it right in the middle have a break and okay what are you doing all right now are you going to actually go and check these guys Oh, so he was full, that's why. He wasn't able to go. Ah, I see, I see. Now, let's f get this finished for you, mister. And then we'll need some ground fiber, of course. Ground fiber. And then, hopefully, that should be done for our good old Cosmos. And then... Oh, something's completed. What's completed? Transmission incoming. Two Chasmosaurs found. Did we get both of them? Only one of them? Okay, well, hopefully he does not get annoyed. We'll just put him right here. And whoa, we just dropped something. Okay, how are you guys? Health is low. Why are you lowering? Why are you so low? You shouldn't be... You got ground fiber. Do you need some ground leaf? Oh, we've got a storm coming. Do we need... F okay, let's try that. Okay, where the hell is the... Where is the jeep? No, I'm actually genuinely serious. Where is... Okay, there it is. It's finally going. But, please tell me we don't have a tornado or something. Please don't. Oh, jeez, we gotta... Oh, my God, we gotta tranquilize some kind of... For uh... Oh, my God, that's real loud. Uh, uh, panic, guys, panic! Tranquilize these two. And tranquilize him. And, uh... God, he's doing status check on these guys. How's... Are these guys good? What do they need? If the animals are panicking, you should be panicking. Okay, what are you doing? Hurry up! Um... Uh... Okay, we gotta fix the fence ourselves. Oh my god, that fixed the fence? Wait, is the turn it? That's it? What? Oh my god, I was shitting my pants! Oh, okay, okay, now I feel bad for tranquilizing these guys, because... I mean, well, Allosaurus was about to, like, be freed. 
Oh my god, that that was a big tornado, but like it was really quick. Okay, so you add task, go there. Okay, so what's up with you guys? What the f- You just did it! Oh my god, I hate this thing. Okay, this has got a problem. Like, he was about to leave and he missed one of the Taurosaurs. Okay, so let's see. How are you guys? 93, what do you need? More forest, okay, thank you. Finally, something. And then we need to check that Chasmosaurus, which, oh my god, we are seriously low. Why are we so low? Okay, so you guys are good. You guys are being dropped down. What about you guys? You guys... Okay, so... Okay, so we're gonna check this guy ourselves. Okay, if we can make it. What are you doing? Drive, buddy. Oh my god, Chasmosaurus, you are tiny. Okay, so what are you missing? Ground leaf. We need more ground leaf. Gotcha. There you go. You are 100% happy. And we are going to drive you to go and check on the Sinos... Well, we're going to fix everything, actually. Complete the asset rating. We should be fine, because we were so close earlier. Okay, do not get out, you Taurosaurus. Let's fix everything. Oh, jeez, they are jumping out of the way. Well, it's smart of them. Okay, so... Oh, ah, ah, panic! All right, now, let's go and get this. And that should make them all good. Now, comfort. Why are you uncomfortable? Ground nut is zero. Okay, we need more of the nuts. Okay, so this gives ground nut, so we'll put that here and a bit over here. Now, are you good? Okay, you guys are good. What about Ankylosaurus? Are you good? You're good. And Sino? Okay, Sinos need to be checked. Where is he? Oh my god, he is so slow. We need another one, okay? So, facility, that's not right. Response facility. We're gonna put one here. And this one's mainly gonna go for this one, because, like, it has so many dinosaurs in it, it needs to be checked, so. So, let's speed it up. And, come on, finish up, almost there, come on, four, three, two, one, go, and there we go. Now you, we're gonna add task, and you are going to check this. Now everything is good, well, it should be good, and are there any other dinosaurs, like, new ones that we need to get? Like, let's see. Okay, this two Baryonyx, we can get them. We'll go for you, and you. And let's speed it up, and we'll make an enclosure for you, my dear Baryonyx. Right over here, I guess. Nope. 
I'm so used to having the enclosure, the viewing vents and f slash facilities in the same spot, but no, it's not this time. Don't know if I like it, but I'll have to suck it up. Alright, you go there, and then we will connect this to that, and then we'll go all the way to the border. And then we'll go here. Oh, no. And that should be good. Oh, New Orleans is done. We'll just connect this right uh, here. Put a gate on right here. And then, of course, two baryonic found. How many did we get? Oh, we got both. Nice. Nice. And we will... First, oh god, write the speed things on. So we'll first add this. And then... Okay, okay. We're making progress. But there's always more to be done. For you, anyway. <laughs> Take this next objective, for example. Okay, so you... Add task. We are going to put you onto this one as well. And then we are going to first get... I know they'll need a lot of water and some sand and some rock. Okay, so now let's go into fish feeder. And then rock well actually first let's get rid of some of these trees I don't think they need all of this like definitely not that much and then we'll go all the way down to here get some rocks dinosaur thr oh shit uh, that's not good. Baryonics are not happy. Okay, nope. We need to add task to you. Tranquilize this guy. Tranquilize this guy. And we need to slow it this down. And we need to f finish. Hold on. We're going to finish their enclosure, actually. I should have done that first. I was an idiot. Okay, so we need more rocks. And maybe one big rock. Or, no, a massive rock. And then we'll add some more rock around here for them. And this got... Okay, so we'll just add... A, there we go. That should be good for them. Now, let's play. Okay, this one's down. Transport you all the way to here and where's the other one okay you got him okay we'll move you to here and we need to drive you to go and fix that baryonyx gate enclosure before they break out so Let's get a move on, shall we? Why am I doing that, Austin? Why? Why do I do these things? Just why, Austin? Why? And also, we're gonna actually keep you here, because we need to check and see what's wrong with our dear old little batteries. 
So, we are going to first shoot. Come on, lower down. Come on, lower down. I know you can do it in the air for some reason. Okay, we're not close enough. Missing forest, it seems. Okay, so we need more trees. Well, that's a shocker. I just got rid of a whole bunch. Okay, there we go. They should be happy. And you, I need to take direct control. Check. And there we go. They are all comfortable. And we are going to speed up time. If I could turn and take a look at that good old berry. And ooh, I like how that one little tree there is perfectly good. And we got all the dinosaurs, I think. Hold on, let's pause. Can we get these ones? Why can we not get these ones? Requirements for... Oh! Okay, so I need that much time played. Well, that just seems dumb. Why the heck is that a thing? Now, Casmo, let's take a look at you, because you're, like, really small now. Like, you're a little... Oh, wait. Pennsylvania's done! Okay! That was... On East yep. A place where the dinosaurs could finally thrive. Minus the volcano. Yeah. Obviously. Big minus. That's a pretty big minus. Yes, it is. Relax, Mesmo. But. But what? I can hear it in your voice. Shh! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Oh, we got some cows. I'm sure that some of the animals were being moved to an undisclosed location. He wouldn't say, or maybe he didn't know who was taking delivery, but it wasn't the DFW. Oh, are we getting bios in here? You and I are not invited. Oh, we're getting bios in here. Hold on, guys. I got an angry dog because someone was nearby. Esme, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Sit down. Sit. And relax. You can't do that while I'm recording. I know. Thank you. Okay, so sorry about that, guys. I just had a do angry dog. Oh, shut up. Oregon! Oh, Pteranodons! But now we're getting radar hits from Portland International. So they're traveling south. Probably yep. Of the weather. Look at that. Ooh. But what happens if one of these animals decides to play chicken with a commercial airliner? It'll it's get smacked by a plane. That's what. A and the course. And the plane will also crash too. You know. So construct all oh, aviaries. Wait. Okay. So we need to construct. If Owen and Lambert do what they say they can, we're going to need facilities in place for the flyers. When okay. They arrive. Oh, we need to research, right. With some Avery domes and a hatchery. Oh, we also need an expedition center. And as you heard, time is not on our side. Uh, okay, Claire. So we'll, we can't use him. He's t tired. So we'll use you and you. Start task. And then we're going to go into here. And we're going to rest you. And I'm sorry, we have to fire you because you you give us nothing. So we'll recruit someone else. Let's see. Who can give us, like, high everything? Like, someone who isn't level one. Which is all we have, for God's sake. Okay, we need... Okay, she would be okay because she's got two of each. You know you... You maybe. You definitely not... Okay, logistics he would be good at. 
She would not be, which we need logistics. So I think we're going to get um, this one because she's like our best at the moment. So there we go. Now, can we research? Are we done the research yet? Nope. Structures, how are we doing? Okay, hold on. We're still in the process of making that. So we'll just speed up time and see if we can find something. Aviary, yeah, we can't build it yet. So this is the map size at the moment, which... Oh, come on. You can't tell me we're not going to be able to build over here. Look at that. That looks so good. Unless... I've actually heard that we won't be able to build in the campaign maps, which is kind of a little saddening. Like, it's not the best feeling. So, research. Now we will send you guys to do... Okay, so what's this? This is the scientist training and... Okay, so let's see. We will get you and you to do it and then that we will do afterwards so let's continue which I don't know let me know in the comments guys because I haven't I haven't heard if it's official yet but if these maps are not going to be able to be used in like challenge or sandbox like yeah, yeah, we're losing money. I know that because, well, that's obvious. Enclosures. We can build now, which... We are going to build the first aviary. And can we... Oh, there we go. And we are going to build a... Okay, can you make it like... Okay, I'm going to make it like that. That is a little bit big, but we should be fine. Now, viewing... Aviary. Okay, so we're gonna have one here and then one. Actually, we'll have one there and then we'll destroy that one and then we'll put. Oh, yeah, we're having that one demolished. So come on, demolish it. Come on, hurry up, pick up the pace. There we go. And now we will put a path. Right here. Oh, the OCD. It's back. It's beautiful. And oh. And now power. I've got the power. Yeah. And now we need an expedition center. We need to construct that. So. Where is that? Expedition. Uh, right here and we're gonna need other things like the nope we already have that so we should be fine and i don't think we need the paleo medical facility and what is so this is the viewing gallery which we also need a hatchery for th these don't we now can we get in oh yeah we can go in avery hatchery how do we do that How do we do... Okay, so we need... Where's the hatchery? Enclosures. Oh, this is the aviary hatchery. My bad, my bad. Okay, so we'll put you there. And then we'll get a path. And then we're actually going to work on the inside of this, which... We're going to first put some water in. Probably not too much. Ready on this end. We can send out expeditions for remote capture. These creatures can cover a lot of ground. Oh, we got snow coming in. We should snap to it. All right, let's fly the not so friendly skies. Okay, go get those pteranodons. We've got to get them this place ready for them. Also, we have captured flyers ready to deliver. Have them brought to the aviary hatchery by our transport team. 
We'll then release them into the domes. And by release, you mean contain? Yes. In a controlled environment and under our supervision and care. Okay, so sorry for cutting just instantly there. Oh, yep. Okay, so I want to apologize for cutting there. There was someone at the door. My dog was barking and I needed to check. And apparently... Oh my god. I don't know if this ever happens to you, but do you guys ever have, like, kids that are in the neighborhood who, like, just think it's funny to go and knock on someone's door and then go running away? Especially if they know you have a dog, which... These kids, it's the same kids that have done it, like, three times this week. And, oh my god. I... Uh, it's just so fun. It's so frustrating, guys. Like, it makes me... F like, especially if, like... They do it multiple times and then you think your dog's crazy and then you see it. You just... This may sound rude, but I just want to kill those kids or like, you know, tell their p parents that they're terrible parents. Because if you let your kids do that, you're terrible parents in my opinion. Because, oh my god, it's so frustrating. Because like, I, f I just feel bad for my dog because now she's she's looking at me like she's in trouble, but she's not. You have idiots going at your doors, knocking for no reason, and running around screaming, which, oh my god. Anyway, anyway, we've got the trend on, sorry for my little rage moment, but that's what you're here for, guys. You're here for the raw, uncut moments of life, but, and if you're not, well, then enjoy them anyway. Uh, okay, so five are captured out of five. So we are going to put all of you in here and also we need to get some rocks and also I want to slow this down because we need to just enjoy this so I think we do need some rocks for them like I know that they can f I'm pretty sure they can land on them and we want some trees I'm pretty sure they will want a few trees okay that is really difficult it's really difficult because it's so short and, oh, wait, 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 where's the Tarandon? Okay, so how do they get in? Do they get, life finds a way. I just saw one Tarandon go in, but how does this work? Oh, flapped. Yep, we got two awards. Oh, so it's a little, ah, I see. So on the hatchery, it's a little drop point for them, which, <laughs> oh my God, look at him. He's like, oh, I hate him. Now, let's see him hatch out. Come on. Oh, there he goes. Can we get on him? There you go. Look at that. Oh, it's so good. Now, lo expanding territory. Missing rock. Wait, what? Hold on. Slow down. Get back here. Let's see. What do you need? Oh, no. You're good. What about the other one? Okay, so they're good. Whoa, they're all here. Now, I know we'll be needing more, so... I'm gonna make another aviary section, because I know that there's gonna be other ones. Like, I'm pretty... I've seen that you'll also have Dimorphodon. And what was it? And Trophy Anagus. So, I'm gonna make this... That's a lot of money, Austin. Jesus, what did you do? Well, we're going to add a hatchery right here. And then we're going to add a... Nope, we need the viewing facility. Which... We will put one here. And then one here. And then we will get the path and put it right uh, over here, and then also that there, and, oh Jesus, I got the sniffles or something, because I've been sneezing all day, okay, wait, what, okay, you guys are good, oh, look at them, Ian! Jeff, my hero! Oh, look at them eat! Just look how it eats. It's dead. Dr. Malcolm, why are you contacting us? Same thing as always. Because he's he's the main character, damn it. 
We don't care about you, Kevin. Oh, look at them! They're on the roof! Oh, he's floating! We got a floating one! Oh dear, he's... Oh, I got a flap. Shut up, Austin. Ian's talking. They should. The hidden hand of chaos is revealed. It's what else remains hidden that's concerned. Oh, George. Oh, yeah, Lambert. Indeed, yes, yes. And that's why I brought somebody with me to help shed some light in this regard. Ooh. Isaac Clement. Oh, good old Isaac. He's back. require feeders if they're to stay healthy stay on top of it yeah a little late for that claire but trophinagus and dimorphodon we're gonna go for dimorphodon first hey i'm isaac Clinton. yeah whatever i don't care <laughs> some specific requirements including a ranger team to gather information and monitor the animals within the aviary a viewing gallery is also on our list so now it's on yours <laughs> Oh, do I not have a... Oh, I don't have a ranger team. Hey, Claire. I've been thinking. When you think it makes me nervous. Oh, damn. Oh, burn, Claire. Nice one. Uh, okay. I'm not following you. Dr. Malcolm starts contacting Dr. Dua from who knows where when these flying reptiles become an issue. Why? Because they introduce a unique danger? And he's concerned. Yeah, that's yeah it's that's Ian, for God's sake. Stop that's complaining. Ahead of ourselves, Owen. For now, we should make sure the satisfaction levels for the flyers is high. That's verifiable data we can use. Forget the conspiracy angle. Hello? We're chasing prehistoric animals, Claire. Reality ain't what it used to be. He's got a point, Claire, but still. What are they leaning to? Is it going to be, like, revealed that Biosyn or something is connected? Uh, it's, it's sort of my thing. <laughs> yes, it is. He's always right. We have enough assets in the pipeline that we should be able to move forward soon. Right now we're putting out brush fires, but this, this is an inferno that could engulf the world. Your concern is noted. For now, I suggest we focus on this location. It's about high welfare and visibility for the animals. And safety for the DFW staff, of course. Learning to coexist with the dinosaurs is a process. We're getting there. And if we don't, where's that leave us? We will have created an apocalypse born of our arrogance. Humanity versus the dinosaurs. And honestly, I'm not sure who deserves to win. Well, honestly... Apart from you, Ian, and Claire, because they're my heroes. If we want to find success, we must look to the sky. That means more flyers, and more species of flyers in the aviaries. Flap, not flop. Huh? 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 <laughs> okay, your jokes aren't working right now. What's up with this? Oh, it's empty. Resupply. Okay, so... There we go, Dimorphodon, six of them found. Ah, uh, one got away, as always. Okay, we're gonna put them in here, because I think it makes sense to have them with these guys. Oh, they're coming from all angles! They're coming after us! Now, let's see. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> he looks so... He's like, what the hell? I should be... Somewhere else. It's like the compies, for God's sake, in evolution. Like, they're just like, they shouldn't be. Oh, and he's flapping around. He's like, ugh, I may be a flyer, but I'm going to be sick. Ooh. He's going to throw up. Okay, so now, Trophy and Agus, let's go for you. Uh, oh, excuse me, I got the burpees. Okay, we'll go with you. And with you, start task. And also... We will need to... Hold on once. That better not be those damn kids again. 
Okay, so we are going to rest you. You're fine. And you guys are busy, so can't use you guys. Now, let's take a look at the Dimorphodon in here, once he gets out, of course. Oh, there he is. Oh, here he comes. Oh, look at that. What a beauty. Oh, he's lonely, a broken hearted. Now he's exploring the territory. Which, I hope he doesn't get eaten or something. Could you imagine what... Like, I don't know if... Qu I know Quetzalcoatlus is not in the game right now, which we'll be getting it for Dominion, guys. We know that. But could you imagine if, like, say, Quetzalcoatlus was, like, say, didn't like Dimorphodon because, like, maybe they were too small and too numerous that they could actually start eating them? Like, because remember, in the Dominion prologue, I'm pretty sure you see one of the... Um, what is it? I can't remember what it was. One of the Tyrannodons, it was nicking at one of them, which maybe it was because it was bugged by them. But could you imagine, like, to a, a Quetzalcoatlus, this guy would be like an insect. Oh, oh, and he's phasing. Oh, he looks so good. And yeah, they definitely succeeded with the pterosaurs, like, a hundred percent. Because, like, with the aquatics, I've already seen a lot for them. And it's a little unfortunate for those guys. Now, are all the Dimorphodons coming in? Not yet. We still got one there and one there. Ugh. And we got... Wait, is that another one? Oh. Is that an... Oh, no. He's leaving. Okay, so... Okay, we're going to speed this up because we need to get... We need to get those Trophionagus as soon as possible, please. Come on, hurry up, almost there. Transportation complete. Incoming transmission. Four fa- Aw, oh, we got all four. Transport right into here. And scientist is rested. And we are going to... Lower the speed, and let's see, how big are the trophy? Oh, look, whoa, look at that skin. Oh, my God. That, hold on, we'll wait for him to come out, and we should have this mission done. I'm pretty sure, because there's only these three. Come on, give me him. Where is he? Oh, look at, look at that bull. Like, uh, what was the one from Walking with Dinosaurs? Like the Giants of the Skies episode. What? Missing fish? They're right there. Oh, he looks... They look so good. Like, even in the first game, like, they looked so, like, dead. Like, the pterosaurs look dead in that game. But here, they look so much more alive and stuff. And I think it's because, like, they're actually given life. Like, sure, he's phasing through trees and stuff. But I'd rather have him phase through a tree then have him just on a loop and he oh there we go are we done don't tell me we're done i want to oh 80 percent now let's get a good shot of this guy because oh look like i'm pretty sure it is based off that skin like it's the model from walking with dinosaurs it's not the same dino pterosaur obviously but still oh there's the other one and one more coming up and I think we have one more after you. So that's basically the animation of them on their first one. It flies in, and then lands, and then comes out. And how are the Dimorphodons? Are they okay? Oh, wait. Ailment. And he's low on stamina. Okay, how do you scan... Okay, so visiting... Oh, he is. Now you're scanning... Oh, so he's got... Oh, yeah, the drone! Right! Okay, so we need to... Oh, wait, we do need the paleo medical facility right... Uh, right here. Which... I guess it can go... Well, right here. We don't real. It doesn't really matter. Now we're just gonna do that. And then we're going to... 
So yeah, time has paused on the 80% comfort because something's sick. Oh, we got another one sick. No, we got them sick. Okay, so now you, your ta your job is quite simple, really. Not to build a park, but to save the dinosaurs. And oh, oh wow, they are all getting sick. What is going on? Now, as long as, if none of them die, we should be fine. Oh, he's injured. He's got a fracture. What happened? Missing sand. Oh, we need sand for you, my dear. Your wish shall be granted, Monsieur Dimorphodon. We shall get you your son. That's snow. That's dirt. That's sand. So, we'll put it right around here. Oh, wait. Oh, something. Oh, that's where the drone came from. Nice. Okay. That should be good. Oh, God. What are they doing? Now, where's the Dimorphodon? Nope. Are they getting injured by the Pterodons? They can't be. Okay, so they're 100% for this. But what's causing the injuries? Oh, organ out. Oh, we're done organ. No, no way. Uh, okay, guys. So we are done with organ. The pterosaurs. No, I didn't get enough of trophy nagus. Has its charms, but what appeals to the senses is the asymmetry of nature. Its rough edges. Oh, so rough. A tree yep. that is both out of place and exactly where it needs to be. Chaos. Much like the dinosaurs. Oh, look Excuse at that shit. Dr. Malcolm, there are reports of a large herd of subject animals roaming freely in Yosemite. Oh, Yosemite, my boy! Don't you just love it? Oh, yeah, I love me some chaos. So, guys, we are going to end this one here. In the next video, we will do the final mission, it seems. So, if you've enjoyed this video, I'd appreciate the like. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button to join the hunt. Be safe, and until next time, I'll see you later. Bye-bye!